Yo guys, thank you so much for dropping by the stream. Whoa. <laughs> huh, let me just pull my mic a little closer to me. I know there's going to be a ton of background sounds while I'm streaming, but at least I can talk to you guys. Y'all guys have to keep up with this first. Please bear with me be until at least I finish building my sound booth, okay? <laughs> I swear, whenever I stream, uh, y'all guys will always hear background noise coming from me. But once everything is set up, it'll be a lot more quiet. And all you will hear from me would be your choice songs. <laughs> Good. Ooh, cool, cool. Also, how are you guys? I know it's been a while since I've last streamed, but what have you guys been up to? So, as to what I've been up to lately, I finished dubbing a really long voice clip for Big Bro over here, a Big Bro Parker. It's one of his Pokemon projects. And I'm just waiting for the video to be published on his YouTube channel. I'll give you guys the link. You guys can see that on Twitter and maybe on Discord too, especially because I don't want you guys missing out on whatever shenanigans I've been up to online. <laughs> I know, I know. Huh. Is it all right for me to like mute my mic on reality here? I do know this, that there's going to be a delay between my reality mic and my stream from YouTube. So you guys will practically hear me double. Also, I cannot read this. Why do I just... Uh, Hiruko. Is that Hiruko or Hiruka? Anyway, welcome to the stream. Thank you so much for dropping by. Hey! Feel free to hang around and chat with us, okay? And also... Yeah, feel free to make up your points, it's totally fine too! Yosh! I'm not rushing, but it'll be great if I have my sound booth done. Also, I hear you guys have a D&D campaign going, how's that? Do you have any funny moments to share with us, Kiva? Okay. Story time. <laughs> I'll send kitten pics in a bit, so you gotta go shopping though. Oh, take your time, Panda. I'll still be here for like... The next couple of hours, I suppose? <laughs> Cause that's like the average time that I'm spending when I'm streaming. Uh, my stamina is not big enough to go far longer than two hours. Shame on me! But... How long I'm just going to be doing my commissions? Let's see, five hours? <laughs> I probably go to bed at around midnight. Why did I turn off my timer? Why? Don't know what the holdup is at this stage. Oh! Nixie's joined you, right? Like, how is that? Uh, how's Nixie with you guys? Who doesn't know about you? <laughs> Say it, son. Akizan still doesn't know about what my exact sleep schedule is, so I'm not going to spoil it here in case Aki is going to watch the playback. <laughs> <laughs> I, I value my sleeping hours. Yeah, I'm, I'm not going to spoil when exactly I wake up in the mornings. I want to sleep at peace. Because, <laughs> you know, it's, it's going to be really awkward when I'm sleeping and she finally comes uh, calling in the unholy hours of the morning on Discord, and I don't want that. Let's see. So I know that, let me just start doing the very rough 
line art for this new guy. So yeah, it doesn't look exactly like the furry artwork that you guys normally see. That's because I'm not exactly a furry artist, I'm a manga artist, so it's more manga-ish than furry, <laughs> if you know what I mean. I don't exactly know how to describe this. And before anything else, I would also like to say that I am a safe for work artist, so there will be none of the any lewd forms of art if you watch my streams, sure, there would be some sussy moments, unintentionally, but <laughs> that's as far as things go. <laughs> Phoenix is also an introvert, I guess. Though, Phoenix does like to talk and often asks me if I'm free for a call. Which I'm not because I cannot exactly tell. Whoa, why did you lick my toes? Ah, that's my floof demon. <laughs> I kind of surprised that you're licking my toes instead of trying to bite them off. What the hell was that? Okay, now to continue. I hope not. Well, I haven't seen Aki around today, so I guess something must be keeping Aki busy. Let's see. My commission list is a bit full right now. Like, apart from the couple of... Um, v uh, I can't exactly say VIP clients. I only have one VIP client right now. Aside from that one, there are about three other people that have commissioned me to draw for their manga and webtoons. And I'm juggling with my work hours so that everybody can like get accommodated and that I don't forget any of them. <laughs> so I'm feeling a little overwhelmed right now. I know, I just assumed that we're around 12 to 13 hours ahead of her. Good luck to you. I hope things don't slap you that hard when you get home. Do take care, okay? Do you guys have fun going around Vietnam? Also, uh, for you, um, creative friendos out there, especially if you're a comic creator. Recently, one of my clients and I have been talking about making an app for comic creators to upload their stuff on. 
but it's a little different. It's a little different. So, this app is for short form comics, which means it's not like webtoons that you have to upload really long panels, multiple panels all at once and are pressured to upload an episode in a week. This one is for short form comics, which means you can upload really short comic strips on the phone and it's going to be available on both Android and on um, Apple. So we're still fleshing out the details. I'm guessing that it, since it's both our first times to actually work on an app like this, it's going to be a lot of trial and error. <laughs> so if you guys are fellow artists, I would also like to talk about that in detail, see how you guys would find this kind of app. Uh, so it's free registry, but there's a limit to the free tiers. Like you can only read the free episodes on that platform. But if you want to read the paid episodes, you'd have to uh, you'd have to pay subscription. So that subscription will cover certain bundles. Like if you pay like three dollars like per per month, you can read three uh, three episodes. But I mean, comics from three creators of your liking. Speak of the demon! Ah, is it time for me to end the stream? <laughs> Akias showed up! Okay, you guys, this is, this is all for the stream. I will see you guys next time. <laughs> yeah, okay, so back to that app. So, I know it's going to be a subscription model. Even the creators would have to pay subscription uh, subscription fees. Yes, in case they're going to read from other creators. But here's the thing. There are different ways that readers can pay for their... For reading comics. Okay, so aside from the subscription, they can also pay per episode. That's a very loose plan. <laughs> Or uh, they can pay for the subscription. I think there are like three tiers for that. There's an only tier, and then there's a bigger bundle tier and a smaller bundle tier. But, well... Oh, so what happens? This doesn't have a subscriber quota. Uh, creators don't need to have a certain number of subscribers to monetize their stuff. Anybody who subscribes to their... Uh, to their series... You'll be sure to get something out of them. Depending on how many times they come back to read your series, you'll have a bigger... Uh, you'll have bigger earnings. Hey! Hey! Friendo who has joined from another art server, welcome! So aside from subscribers monetizing, monetizing your comic, art from the subscribers that are paying subscription fees just to read your series. Uh, creators also have their own private marketplace where they can sell digital goods or goods from well, their own merch, so... <laughs> yeah, because um, my friendo, aka my client, also was asking for feedback from me. Because we kind of don't want to go the same way that Webtoons did and other Webtoon platforms did because we've seen we've seen so many artists kind of find monetizing their stuff really sticky. So we're trying to find a balance between how they can monetize and how subscribers can willingly pay for the stuff that they read. Just, you know, to support their artist. <laughs> um, you, you wanna go get uppies? But I won't be able to hear anything from you, Aki. Go man, go man. Go man. Um, I don't think I can let anyone on a collab tonight. But tomorrow morning when I go stream and then maybe do avatar ratings. And do talent shows, y'all can come up and show us what you got. 
Maddie, welcome back. How was cool? Yeah, I know, Kiba. So, if you guys have any suggestions as to what you're expecting from the app, please let me know. Now, nothing will be... We can't guarantee that the features that you're, you're suggesting will be implemented on the first patch of the app because we're starting things really simple and clean here. But we're keeping an ear out for anybody who's giving us really nice suggestions so everybody can get comfy when they're using a app, okay? Switching periods, oh, okay. Gomene, okay. And I see Lolo Nuwaru. Hi! Thank you so much for visiting the stream. Of course. I don't know. I already have a busy schedule and I'm also planning for an app. This is the first time I'm actually taking part in app development. Now, uh, I'm not the one building the app. My friendo and I were the ones um, putting together the design and how the wireframe looks. But, of course, we have our own... Um, app developers and designers and we're waiting on the UI so that we can beta test it <laughs> so I'm the one who's doing the beta test on Android and my friend Joe is the one doing the beta test on Apple yeah we are <laughs> it's for um, artists yes It's for artists who would like to upload their comics through the phone. But it's for it's specially made for really short comics so that artists are not really pressured to upload entire episodes in a week. They can choose to upload whenever they want, multiple times in a week if they want. In short form comics like you know those four coma short strips. So if you're the, the kind of artist who does that, then this is probably the app for you. Now, of course, you can also upload your webtoons here. Yeah, and artists can set where... which episode they would like to put under paid... Uh, I don't know, I know. <laughs> A pay gate? I think that's what they called it. Episodes that are paid. I'm probably going to upload an actual video explaining the features for the app. But yeah, here I am spoiling about it to you guys because I love ya. <laughs> oh, now you know what kind of ritual you have to do just to get scared, Mushaki. Thank you so much, we'll do our best. Yeah, it's our first time trying to make a nap. <laughs> Hopefully it works out. Please, let me know if you would like to give us feedback about this. Also, also, um, I know that Webtoon has comment sections and stuff like that so that people can comment on episodes that they like and stuff. But our app comes with... we won't be implementing a, com a comment section in the first versions of the app. But we do come with a rating system so that people can leave reviews on each episode or every comic strip that has been uploaded. And in the later, in the later parts of the app, like later versions, I think we're planning to put up... Um, drop down menus like which part of the comic they like so that creators will know which part of the comics are really liked by their fans also woo hey welcome 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 to the stream feel free to pick up your points by the way also wow wow what is this <laughs> this is rather unique Olivia, is that how I say her name? Thank you for liking the broadcast. 
No worries, Kiba. And thank you so much for always supporting. I really, really appreciate you guys. Hit all. Apparently today I'm not your six-winged angel. I'm your local flying oni. <laughs> I was wearing a kitsune mask earlier this morning, but I figured, hey, if I'm going to talk to you guys, I might as well show you my face, because it's kind of awkward not showing you guys my face. Or at least half my face, because I have an eye patch. Uh, to be veil. How do I say this name? Either way, welcome. MJ, welcome too. Feel free to pick up your points, make friends, listen to the music, maybe chat about random stuff here. Don't worry, we don't bite, except Aki. Aki stabs. <laughs> Restricting comments is healthier. Uh, liking system, I'd also suggest locking the ability to comment after someone has liked to limit potential. Yeah! The, the first patches of this app will not have a comment system. We were actually debating whether it would be nicer to have a rating system, a rate and review system instead of the comment system. So, yeah, I guess it's a lot better. If you're just going for feedback and stuff, at least comic creators get actual constructive feedback <laughs> for their comics. Oh, thank you so much for liking the broadcast. Much appreciated. Thank you, thank you. Layla, welcome. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, whichever part of the world you happen to be from. Feel free to pick up your points, or maybe just stick around and chat with, with the rest of us here. Don't worry, we don't bite. <laughs> oh, thank you so much for the follow! Hey, hey, hey! Here, have a heart! Duh! I like dolphins, thank you so much! Thank you, thank you! Um... Oh, that is so cute! It's the first time somebody gifted a dolphin. Hey, that is so cute. Yeah, you always do stabby stabby, Saki. Ouch. Ouch, ouch, ouch. My elbow. I should really work on my avatar on my days off. <laughs> I look so dang plain. <laughs> no, I mean not on reality. My avatar is far from plain on reality. I'm talking about my actual VTuber avatar. It looks so damn plain. My elbow will survive. Thank you for your consideration, Aki. Ah. The dolphin! I just realized the dolphin moves! Whoa, thank you! Aw, that is so cute! Did Shiro do something to his model? The last time I checked, it was all military-like. Harmony, hello! Welcome, welcome, welcome to the stream! Hey, why is a dolphin lying on its side now? Maybe an upgrade is in order? <laughs> yeah, I hope so too. Just to give you... Okay, here's something. I do have a live 2D model. The thing is... Um... I'm just waiting for enough funds so that I can commission Kiba-san over here to rig my lovely, lovely first live 2D model. <laughs> Cause I like the way Kiba-san rigs her models. If you guys drop into her stream from time to time, you will see just how fancy her rigging is. 
Me tiro de mal do seu posto. Ele pode vir. Ah. Yeah. I do try to be friendly, ok? I promise my future models will not look like it's about to punch someone. <laughs> I'm like the friendliest little brother you'll meet on the street. I promise. Uh, well, if you go ahead and drink something cold, you will feel funny after waking up. Am I here to remind everyone to stay hydrated? Thank you so much for the reminder. Yes, you're absolutely right. You guys don't forget to stay hydrated, okay? Thank you so much for the friendly, friendly memo. Also, Sasori, welcome, welcome. Oh, first time on this stream, hey! Feel free to join the convo or maybe just pick up your points. That's totally fine too. Ah, there we go. Thank you so much for the rose! Thank you, thank you, thank you! Of course Butler's on it. I mean, you already have an avatar here on reality. That's a really, really great start. Alright, so you guys were listening to this on reality. All of a sudden the background is quiet, but you will be hearing the background music on my stream instead. <laughs> I have a demon floof. You and I know that very well. Ramen with mac and cheese, that's a new one. Uh, can you confirm something with me, you guys? A lot of people swear by ramen and peanut butter. Does that taste good? Does, does that taste good? <laughs> Ew. <laughs> it doesn't sound good. Ramen and curry, that would be great, but... I know, it kind of sounds... Kind of sounds weird, the ramen and the peanut butter. So... Oh! Oh, look who it is! Big Bro Porker! Welcome, welcome, welcome to the stream! Yosh, how are ya? I know, it's been a while since I've last streamed here. Uh, Y'all guys have already accepted the fact that sometimes I am I resurrect and sometimes I die again. <laughs> but I'm used to it. I have unlimited lives because I live in the virtual world. Not me low-key calling myself a shut-in, which I'm not. There's a difference between living in the virtual world and being a shut-in. <laughs> Alright, getting called into work. Oh, the day's just starting where you're from, Big Bro Parker. Please promise that... 
uh, you take care, okay? Don't overwork yourself and do take breaks. And no skipping meals. That goes for all of you, okay? Ah, don't you guys just love really awesome teachers? 150, you're leaving for school. Ooh. Eskop is a psychopath. You eat peanut butter straight out of the jar. <laughs> oh, I used to not like peanut butter at all. But eventually I did. Just not the very sweet ones. Fresh and new with a little different style. So, Butler Sensei, what do you have in mind? Not going for the dandy, um, dandy stereotype? How about sophisticated British dude? Nudge, nudge, wink, wink. <laughs> noni, 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 noni. Mayo and toast. I confess I have a very guilty addiction to mayo sandwiches. <laughs> Toasted or not. Peanut butter sprinkled with sugar. No. Uh... You add sugar on top of peanut butter. Not exactly my favorite. But if we're talking about peanut butter cups from Reese, <laughs> I won't say no to that. Yes, yeah, sometimes I get confused when people start typing in certain fonts because all I see are question marks. Question marks, question marks. Oh, reference pics. Yes, please. On me, why did I ignore this absolutely creamy tapioca? Hmm. <laughs> Damn it, sis, you're not gone yet. <laughs> I was about to comment about the tapioca. Like, let me sing praises about this absolutely heavenly dessert. Mmm. I mean, Yoga should have this. There's even bits of mango thrown in here somewhere. And fruit. Or from these little tapioca pearls that I put in here. It's absolutely delicious and creamy. The type that melts in your mouth. With every swallow. Mmm, that's delicious. You don't like mango, big bro? Well, if not mango, they could put in sweet corn. I've got really weird taste buds. <laughs> This isn't a, no, it's not, it's dessert. Sweet corn, you know. Uh, most of our desserts here are milk or cream based. So it's either fruit 
and sometimes you get raisins and corn in them. But I'm eating tapioca right now. <laughs> now, corn and mango, I don't know what to feel about that. It's either one or the other. Take your time, big bro. <laughs> Uh, each one of us has our pace when waking up in the mornings. <laughs> well, lucky you, Aki. There's no boba shop anywhere near me. It's like 15 minutes away. <laughs> By car. So yeah, isn't milk tea usually made from black tea? Mmm. Absolutely delicious. Can't really get enough of these creamy sweetness. And so sorry about the background noise, by the way. Our dogs are really lively tonight. Mmm. Hey. Oh, there's some cheese in this! Mmm! Now, why would they do that? Why did someone say shut up to you? I'm a little in the zone right now. Uh, not really. Those are the other fluke demons outside the house. No shot. Right now they're tethered outside, but a little later in the evening they'll be let go so that they can roam around to patrol, uh, the grounds of our place here. You know, safety reasons. I think you're also a little too young. Uh, I'll just leave this to the commissioners to see how they'll react. This little guy. This guy is... <laughs> okay, he's a lot cuter than the... Dog's character concept that I made not so long ago. Whoops, what did I... Did I erase that?
There will be no sussy moments t here tonight. I promise you guys that. So many dogs go in. Guess there must be some visiting dogs. I know! Go away! <laughs> That's something I need to work on, seriously. a few times here on Reality Aki. It's always chaotic. I'm gonna lie, it feels kinda weird drawing the Anthro art. Takes some getting used to to be honest. Now, why is it that every time I actually stream for a long time is when I make character bases, when they don't have clothes? That's like a lot of moments that you can catch me saying sussy things. Let's not have a repeat of what happened the last time. <laughs> Nani, nani, nani. Hey! <laughs> Thanks for the eye mask and the coffee. Thank you so much. I need that. Even though I technically can't have coffee because it keeps me up all night. Um. The originals? The original Disney ones? Yeah? I... I did? Why? Vanessa! Hey! Welcome to the stream! Why is there a torch down there? <laughs> welcome to the stream! Feel, feel free to pick up your points or maybe just join us and chat. I'm pretty sure that none of us bite except Aki over here. And I did. Yeah. Like, even the jungle book, I guess? The Little Mermaid? Like, the old animated movie? Yeah. I remember not liking Alice in Wonderland that much. I mean, what's wrong with it?
What do you mean? But you probably watched other kitty shows. It doesn't have to be Disney. I mean, Disney isn't exactly the benchmark for the quote unquote I've had a childhood. <laughs> Clifford? Nah. Haven't watched Clifford myself. Uh, I'm a little weird as a kid. So I don't really watch, um... Cartoon... Uh, kitty cartoons? <laughs> I barely remember what cartoons I watched growing up. No, yeah, what I was watching was um some interest some interesting random stuff on Discovery and Nat Geo. <laughs> I remember I was looking up for these dinosaur documentaries <laughs> just for the dinosaurs. I wasn't listening to anything that they're saying at all. <laughs> more slender than the doggy person that I drew before. Shoulders are a little smaller. His muscles are not that defined. But no, it doesn't, it doesn't work out. Or like... Is he an intellectual? He is a vocalist after all. For breakfast, that's unusual for breakfast. Wait a sec, how long have I been streaming? <laughs> it's almost an hour into my stream. And how long have I been here on reality? Uh, how do I up? I'm this thing. One hour and thirty-two minutes. Not bad. Not bad at all. Keep flipping this just in case it's weird. Uh, it looks kind of weird when I do. Do I? Let me just give you a smaller chin like this. Works. That's a lot better.
Bucky, you put him up to it, didn't you? Beef, cheese, and eggs. Mmm. Yeah, we do have such breakfast options here in the Philippines too. Like our our usual breakfast consists around rice paired with either I don't know hot dogs or a beef jerky or corned beef, and those three options either come with sunny side eggs or scrambled eggs. Though I think Sesan has. A lot fancier option because it comes with cheese, ours don't. Unless we order all the cheese at some fancier restaurant. Yeah, they're usually really cheap too. Just perfect to start your day. Served with a cup of coffee, or maybe hot chocolate, whichever you would like. You guys are starting to get dizzy because I keep moving my canvas around. I'm sorry, this is my habit. <laughs> this is what happens every time you see me draw here. habit of drawing with my canvas zoomed out because I really need to see how it's coming together instead of drawing when I'm zoomed in. <laughs> Otherwise, it'll look kind of... Oh, good luck kiss for the Scaradrop. Uh, can't guarantee that any interaction with me comes with good luck, but here you go. Mwah. Good luck. Going back to Genshin, good luck on those poles, Aki. through the same thing, by the way. Before I started drawing with a tablet, I had just my phone, the camera, and yeah, the app that's on my phone. <laughs> I don't know how you guys do that with your finger arts because it's hard as hell. Okay, I, I don't really have very big patience when it comes to drawing on small screens. I like drawing on big screens, that's why. I'll show you something funny. You know what my first tablet was? It wasn't even a branded tablet. It was one of these really cheap tablets from a cheap electronic store. 
Uh, I don't know if you guys know of CDR King, but... We had one of those cheap tablets that they're, they're selling for like less than $50, I think, back then. So that was my first tablet. And you know that stuff that you buy from CDR King is either a hit or a miss. Luckily, mine was a hit. It wasn't a dud. So it stayed a few years with me. Oh, thank you so much for the broadcast, Tower Maddie. Thank you, thank the My English is dying because I'm so grateful. There we go. <laughs> Keith, you have to go so soon? Aw, take care, son. I never had a branded tablet like Samsung and stuff. I did have the knockoff ones like Kobo. I I I can't just some animate with my finger on a tiny ass. I don't know how you guys have that kind of patience. Cherry, you have my respect. Be able to do that on the phone and to animate on top of that. I don't think I have that kind of patience at all. Oh, it's all right. Feel free to express yourself. Just don't go bad mouthing people. That's fine. That's the only rule I have here. Don't be rude. B-Stars. I've always wondered how they look like outside of their clothes. <laughs> like how they drew the animal forms inside underneath all those clothes. Just really, really curious. You just have more patience when it comes to art. I know I do. And I'm generally impatient when it comes to other things. Oh, it's your mom's birthday. Please tell her happy birthday from us. Happy birthday, Maddie's mom. Say-san, Say-san, what's the weirdest thing that you've experienced in your travels in Vietnam so far? Funny adventures also. I like listening to people's funny adventures. <laughs> now here we are with the crotch part again. <laughs> Don't comment about the crotch part, it will still be covered with clothes. This is a base template. Brother drawing wasabi, why? He hasn't tried wasabi before? Ah, Jerry, come on. I'll let you in on a little something. A few years ago, 
I didn't even know how to draw girls. Like, the biggest problem part I had with drawing girls was drawing their boobs. <laughs> I, I swear. <laughs> let's say, um... Let's say where I put the boobs is just under the collarbones. It's like, it looks like it's connected to the collarbones. <laughs> Uh, and they look really squished, like squished meat buns. So, I'm not a. I don't know how I'm going to share that to you guys. That was years and years ago. I don't know if they. I even have any surviving artwork from that time. I'm still drawing! <laughs> still drawing! Another fun fact, by the way. Since your little brother TK here is just a bunch of data because I'm a sentient AI, generally people call me he, because that's how I first appear. But I don't exactly have a gender because I'm just a bunch of data. That's why I sound halfway between a girl and a guy. Kids in the street, homeless, oh, you see some of that um, when you visit here too. And I guess that's a thing that's happening all over Southeast Asia in general. We have some poor districts also. But, we're doing the best we can. I've started drawing the feet like this because gener uh, last time that I had a drawing stream and I was working on the other character concept like for the dog, I also asked people in the stream which would be a good way to draw their feet and some of you guys suggested I draw them half uh, half animalistic like it's paws on the uh, on the end instead of toes. That actually worked pretty well. So thanks for that, you guys. Wow, why are you tiptoeing like that so much? It's 
plan in this one out here. Okay. Someone's screaming inside. What happened? I hope everything's okay. Oh, um, normal human ears or? Cat ears, animal ears. Sometimes I make mistakes when it comes to animal ears too, cause... It, do you sometimes experience um, parts where your sketch and your... The first time you draw it, it looks okay, but then you start inking them and suddenly they all look so wrong? <laughs> cause that happens a lot. <laughs> lines. Sketches are always the best. I like sketches too. I don't like inking much. Sometimes I'm scared to ink sketches because they all look so good. bother with the rulers here either. This is why I flipped canvas. Funny way of doing things here.
Ooh. Wow, your friend sounds like an awesome person. Also, forgettable. Thank you for liking the broadcast and thank you for coming by the stream. I hope you're having a good day and good night. Also, for you guys who are not able to see anything that's going on here on reality, uh, yeah, I'm also simul streaming this on the mobile app called Reality, which is for VTubers who would like to stream on their phone. It's a great place for you guys to test the waters if you're planning to ever be a VTuber. Gets you used to talking to people. <laughs> Let's not do this. <laughs> I think it's better for me to look to do like artistic cen censorship, but if I do put for where it's at, that's gonna look really weird. Okay. I don't wanna put too much fur that's sticking out here and there because I'll be drawing clothes over this and it'll be weird if they stick out of the clothes when I draw over these. Oh, does your friend have an Instagram or Twitter that I could follow? I'm always on the lookout for new artist moods. YouTube and DeviantArt. I used to hang around with DeviantArt a lot more, but I became a little more active on Twitter. And here on Reality. And sometimes I stream more actively here on YouTube. <laughs> Twitch, not so much. I'll probably stream again tomorrow. Probably. No guarantees.
Oh, y'all guys didn't hear that. Sorry about the background noise. Our dogs are absolutely lively tonight. Oh, I haven't heard of Scratch before. Duh. So sad to hear that, Cherry. Dang, that's tough. <laughs> Which one? The doggos? They're fully barking at some of the neighbor's dogs that come in and out. I mean... It's an open beach right in front of us and the tide is out, so some of the dogs sometimes... Come visiting here. That's kind of that, like, their way of calling out to the neighbors. <laughs> what kind of dog is he? So the loudest dogs I know would probably be, um, huskies, the living sirens. Who needs an alarm clock when you have a husky? But my demon flip is also an alarm clock. He just knows when to wake us up. You're headed, Chihuahua. Nani? Wow, I didn't know Chihuahuas could be that loud. The Chihuahuas are evil. <laughs> they tiny ankle biters, yes they are. Yuri's on! Welcome! Hey, dropping by the stream, how are ya? Yes, you are live! It's been a while! How are ya, how are ya, how are ya? Rocco is not evil, trust me, so Rocco is... just loud. Simply loud. Ah, sounds like a sweet dog. Well, I guess that makes up for him being so loud. <laughs> Is it just grizzle outside? Eh? We've been having rainy days for like the past couple of weeks and hopefully we don't get rains anytime soon because 
we gotta want our sunshine too. But this is what happens from June all the way to the end of the year. Again, what do you expect? Tropical climate. 8 p.m. <laughs> Did you fall asleep, Seisan? Everything okay? Maybe you should rest. Sounds like you've had a long day. Oh, not at all. I don't mind at all. I really like when people chat. Although, I'm just double checking. I'm one hour and almost 30 minutes into this stream, so I'm only going to end the stream. Um, Sometime soon too, because it's getting late where I am. It's 9.30, time check. 9.30 in the evening where I am. And I'm making a point to actually go to bed a little early, because recently um, I've gone back into the habit of actually waking up early and then starting early. And I'm on a roll, so... I wanna keep a healthy habit. <laughs> I used to stay up way past midnight. Sometimes I still do, but I still try to get at least six hours of sleep, eight if I'm lucky. Because I don't want to suffer the same health issues um, some of the other artist senpais have. Yeah, remember you guys, if you're an artist, please do remember to watch after your health. You won't be able to get your commissions done if you're sick. Okay, okay. Just gonna chill here and bit and lurk. Why did you why did you just come right now? <laughs> eyes, welcome! You guys, this is my friend of Visual Eyes. If you guys have uh, are looking for people who know how to edit videos, cinematics, stuff that's really really fancy, check him out. His stuff is high quality. So you have to ask him if he's free right now. <laughs> Just got home. Wow, so late. You been up to? You've been on a date, haven't you? If you haven't had dinner yet, my dude, go grab some dinner. And I know your schedule. Ah, uh, you're you're a lot busier than I am, so get some rest too. Let's go. He is a cool dude, ex cop. Yes, the dudes who are hanging out in my chat sometimes are very cool. Especially these two are talking to each other right now. <laughs> Ton of chapters. Oh, you're reading up on some webtoons? What have you guys been reading these days? Any cool manga that I may have missed? Oh yeah! Unless you guys know this one, Zombie 100 is already up in as an anime and I've been waiting for that to happen because I was reading Zombie 100 when it was still a manga and I know that it is pretty niche. Not many people read that. I don't know me I don't know a lot of people who read that. And I was really really pleasantly surprised when the anime just went out like that like bam. Oh, it was a super cool manga, well deserved! So if you guys haven't read or watched Zombie 100, please do! It's not horror, by the way! <laughs> The 
Manga is actually pretty fun. Oh, what's the book called? Might I interest you in a couple of books that I've um that I've worked for others <laughs> with? I've got a couple of authors who are commissioning me right now, so it's not too late for me to plug in their stuff. <clears throat> so let's see. <laughs> the first author that you might you guys might want to check if you're into sci-fi and dystopian novels would be The Black is Blue. It's available on Kindle. They also have the audiobook version, who is narrated by none other than your favorite Genshin's Bennett's voice actress. You give the audiobook a listen too. <laughs> it's hard to believe that uh, we've got her doing the audiobook and I'm doing the graphic novel. But yeah, there we have it. Also, the next novel that I could suggest to you guys is... Well, 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 let me double check the title of this author's book because this one is based on K-pop. The, the behind the scenes of K-pop, really. Now, let me see. Ah, here we go. Come back by Ashwood and Rose. I think this one is also on Amazon. Yes, it is also on Amazon and it's got a rating of 4.5. So if you're into K-pop or K-series or K-drama -st styled stories, you go check him out. Also, there's this one other author here that I'm working with. I don't know if he has a book somewhere out there, but... Uh, I'll also plug his book if he does have any book published out there. So, so far, yeah, those are the two novels that I've been commissioned art for. <laughs> if you guys have the time, and uh, maybe a little bit of moolah to support these two authors. Yep, much appreciated. General surgery. <laughs> That's that'll put me right to sleep. Eyes, my dude. I wish your books would be as entertaining as manga. Well, maybe they would be entertaining as entertaining if they're actually illustrated like manga, like you know, Doctor Blackjack or. <laughs> Use free trial do. Says on knowing how it works out there. You know, anybody who drops in on my stream, they'll probably think I'm drawing hairy legs <laughs> out of context. Probably think they're probably gonna think that I have some weird fetish going on. Of course, they're anatomic <laughs> anatomically accurate. <laughs> oh, medical books are the only books that are are anatomically accurate, like a hundred percent. You stood, up, you stood up until 5 a.m. How can you remain standing up until 5 a.m. and still be not conscious? 
Dude, you gotta teach me how you did that. Or I wish I could have run into you like a ton of years ago. Like maybe a decade ago. Cause maybe I should I could have asked you what your technique was because I need to stand up straight and sleep through the flag ceremony. <laughs> Guys, it's getting late. Get some rest. laugh right now because you know the color of this character is still white but I had to color him in an off-white shade so that I can tell if I'm if I'm not uh, blending with the background here or not. <laughs> Eesh. You know that it's getting late when my English is starting to stumble. I can't speak English straight when it's getting late. It starts disappearing on me, little oh, traitor. Yes, it is. It's almost 10 o'clock, so I should start getting ready to go to sleep. <laughs> Yep, I belong here. You're always welcome here. Because this is what you'll be seeing on my future streams too. <laughs> Sometimes I'll be doing webtoon art, but I think for the next few streams, this is all you'll ever see. <laughs> Sorry about the noise too. Thanks for bearing with me, you guys. Yosh! It'd be floofy. I mean, only the head part is kind of floofy, but... Yeah. Ooh! I still have about uh, mm, three characters for the main group to finish. I have to do this a little faster also, at least for this week. I still have to design two outfits for this guy. Then hop on to the girl next. Hail because why not? I had to switch to Clips and Clip Studio because this one was being dated on Psy, but seeing a white interface gave my eyes hell. So hooray Eclipse Studio for having a dark mode. <laughs> Sai doesn't have a dark mode. I wish it did. I mean, I think Sai too had dark mode, but 
It isn't like this. And most of my brushes are on side 1, which didn't have dark mode. Settings and flow. And now we start with the base color. There we go. Uh, should be somewhere here. The voice line I did is already done. <laughs> I submitted it already, and now it's being edited into the rest of the video, so I can't wait to listen to it when the video is out. So Big Bro Parker was in the chat earlier and he was the one who's doing the project with a ton of other Why did you manage to escape me? Why is this? Why <laughs> Anyway yeah Um I'm going to be posting the finished video with everybody's voice lines in Plus the game walkthrough on my Discord and on Twitter. You know, getting my word, getting the word out there. Oh, there are dogs out there are on a roll tonight. Very lively bunch. Let's start doing the. Okay, now I know it's blue. I know it's blue, but bear with me. <laughs> I needed something a little off white. Oh, when until I start on the tiger? They've got the tiger arrival. And a lion one there too. And looking up references for these animal dudes are actually pretty fun. Clip Studio is so comfortable to work with. It took me some time to get used to them, but... Uh, here I am! Oh, 
downside about this is they don't have the same brush tool I had in paint tool side because paint tool side automatically overlaps um, the color on top of the base like it automatically blends everything which is really awesome I kind of have to do trial and error whenever I have to do that here Audacity. Audacity is a good program to start with. Got any questions, Brother Son? Scribble to break up or something. Oh, you're challenging yourself with emotional lines. I want to listen to that. I just pay your flip a clip. Hey, those are really, really good apps, also. I mean, I don't use flip a clip. And I've tried to use Ibis, but I never, I can never get used to it at all. Cause I got used to Psy and Clip Studio first. So why learn other stuff when you're already using a perfectly good app, right? Just use what you're comfortable using. If it works for you, then you don't need to try and use other stuff. I mean, that's where you do best, right? At the very least, you have a phone and you can draw with your finger. That's better than nothing.
Yosha, I can't wait to hear it, butler -san. Also, it's getting really late where I am, and it's exactly 10 o'clock. So, it's time for me to head to bed. I'll be wrapping up this stream in a few minutes, you guys. I just want to let you know that I really, really appreciate you guys coming over to chat with me and watch the stream too. I really like having company when it comes to working on my commission. So, yeah, if you guys have um, any social medias that you would like me to follow you guys on, please let me know. I have Twitter right over there, it's flashing on the screen, it's flashing on uh, the little the little line right beside me. And I also follow you guys back, okay? Yes, it's time for me to sleep. Also, if you guys want to join my Discord, uh, just send me a little DM, maybe on Twitter. Or comment down below on my YouTube video after my live and I'll let you know how you join. No saw. Don't worry, I don't bite. We don't bite there. There are no people uh, who bite other people there except for maybe Aki. Yes. <laughs> it's a total safe place for people who just want to look for friends. And with that said, thank you so much for dropping by my stream. Also, you guys on reality, I think I'll hang around for a little bit and chat with you guys if you like. But for now, to you guys who are watching this stream on YouTube and on Twitch, I'll see you guys next time. This is TK signing out. <laughs>